Yo people, get you in here for another video. So guys, this video is gonna be on the Iowa map and we are going to be harvesting for our first time in this series. So all these uh, videos you've done so far, by that I mean we've done one video and one live stream, uh, but in those we were planting soybeans on two different fields. If we look at the map right here, you see field 14 and field 13. So 13 was the live stream, 14 was the video. But yeah, now, now they're grown. They actually grew a lot faster than I thought they would. So it's time to harvest them. Now, can we can we turn on this light? Uh, nope, that's the outside light. Okay, this light just doesn't always want to work. All right, that that's, oh, there we go, perfect. <laughs> and then we can open up this big door because we do have to get our T560i John Deere uh, harvester or combine out of here. So this door opens a little bit slowly, <laughs> but it's all good. And then let's actually close this outside door, the exterior door, just because we don't really, we don't really need that open. There we go. Let's start her up. Perfect. Working good. And ooh, okay, our window is a little bit dirty. Um, interesting. Let's drive on out of here. Watch these side walls because we do have a giant header on here. And we are looking good. So we're just going to pull out straight and then we can start turning here. Uh, now one thing too guys, just want to mention quickly, this is on our dedicated server where Patreon supporters and channel members can join. Um, actually, I don't know if I've ever seen a channel member join the server. It's always Patreon supporters. Um, but yeah, either way, so if you guys want to join here like Liam, who's currently on top of our shed is uh doing but if you guys want to join in on here and have your own farm and potentially even help out in some videos and live streams definitely join patreon page link for that will be down below so yeah that's pretty cool anyways i think we're gonna go to the further field right now there we go okay watch our driving yeah so we have a pretty big header on here i don't know the exact size we actually can check uh, it is 7.6 meters. Now, if you guys don't know what a meter is, then I don't know what to say because I don't know the conversion. But yeah, I'm, I'm Canadian. We use meters here in the metric system. Pretty cool. We, we do things right. I know I'm going to hear some feedback about that in the comments. <laughs> be nice, guys. Be nice. Okay. <laughs> um, but yeah, no. The other system's good too. But like, yeah, Can Canadians, we know where it's at. Anyways, let's turn on our hazards. Now, there is the passenger script on here. So just to kind of show you guys, it's a little bit cool. If we hop out here, we can enter as a passenger and anyone else can do this too. So you see right now we're actually sitting in the passenger seat, but we can change that up, right? We click N and then currently, where are we? We are standing at the side. Look at that guys. So we don't really have any controls in this seat obviously, but, or it's not really a seat, because we're standing. Oh uh, yeah, we can also hold on to the back here. See so we have one hand on the ladder and then the other hand is just holding that little rail. So that's pretty cool. But there is Liam. Let's go ahead and enter the driver's seat and then we can get started. Liam might hop on the back here. Let's see. Oh, he hopped inside. There we go. Now he's on the back. Perfect, okay. So yeah, let's turn this thing. Oh, we first gotta unfold it. Whoopsie. There we go. Let's unfold this. We will turn on our header and we can now get moving. So we'll see how much this thing fills up. Uh, we currently do not have a trailer though. So that is something we definitely need to get. Now, I also just want to mention though that we currently have $30,000 in the bank. So we're going to have to be very uh, wise with what our purchase is. Because if we purchase a very small trailer, uh, that is more budget friendly. The issue with that is eventually we're gonna have to get a bigger one, right? Uh, probably sooner rather than later. And it's it, like it's I don't know, it's gonna be a mess, right? But if we get a giant trailer, we either have to use all of our money or take out a loan potentially. Or if I don't know, if worse comes to worse, we will literally just go fully bankrupt in all ways, and that is not ideal. So we kind of want to find one that's in between uh, and just see what works best anyways let's do some first person action we do have a little friend beside us 
Yeah, I think actually, just so you guys know, um, I usually don't shout out people in videos. Usually that's a live stream thing, but I, I, I'm not even sure what Liam's channel is. Uh, but either way, he, I believe, is recording kind of like behind the scenes right now for his channel, which is something you guys can do too when you join the server. And yeah, so that's pretty cool if you guys want to see another perspective kind of riding on the side here. Let's raise our header. There we go. And turn around. So that one pass did 10%. So we're going to have to get a, a trailer sooner rather than later. Which means this video looks like that is what we will be doing. And I wish our planter, or yeah, our planter, I wish it was this size because. Ooh, wait, do we want the. Uh oh, wait a minute. What if we. Yeah, I don't think we want the straw to be behind us, right? Yeah, probably not. Because that's just going to be effort to clean up, and we don't really have the equipment for that quite. Okay, why aren't you working? Why, why did this stop working? Do we have to have that enabled? Um, hmm. We might have to. Because... Yeah, this kind of just stopped. Unless this isn't grown yet. No. Okay, wait. Let's try driving forward. No, you know what? It seems like we do have to enable that. Alrighty. We will figure out a solution in the future to this. Nope, this is still not working. Um, uh, Mom? What? What? Dad? Someone, why, why aren't you working? I'm honestly not quite sure. Let's turn this off for a second, maybe. Like, that looks the same as what we were just harvesting. This is all planted at the same time, too. And I have let quite a bit of time go past. There we go. It seems to be working now. Yeah, so, okay, wait, can I disable this? Let's try it just one more time. There we go. That seems to be working right. Perfect. I'm not quite sure what happened initially, but, yeah, that, that looks a lot better. So we are all good. Okay. Let's go first person and keep on moving. There we go. Nicely done. Yeah, that was definitely weird. I will look into that. Hopefully we can figure out what caused it to happen. It's very, very strange. We are actually missing a few crops when we go first person. That's another one of those things that over time we'll get better with. But until I'm more experienced at farming, we will have to switch to third person a little bit. Okay, what I'm actually going to do here as well is... Instead of just turning right away, or like, I could follow the way the crops are, but I want to be cutting everything straight. So let's just go straight and we can go back for that last little section in a few moments. Oh, okay. Again, it's not working. Is it that maybe we're going too fast when we're downhill? No, it's literally just this doesn't want to work all the time. Hmm. Okay, what if we turn this off, turn it back on? Yep, that's it. Okay, I'm going to look into what's causing that to happen because obviously that is not proper. At least I don't think it is. Maybe this thing just needs a cool down sometimes, but I've never heard of that being a thing in farming simulators. So, yeah, a little bit, a little bit strange. Anyways... This is probably a good time to throw in a message from our sponsor. Join Lava Mod's Patreon page to instantly receive access to some amazing modding creations. You will get early access to Lambo, Winston, and Beardshot's awesome ideas. On top of all that, you will get cool textures and other unique modding tools. Join today using the link below. Okay guys, so let's keep on going. And I think what we will probably end up doing is a little bit of a time lapse in a little bit. Well, let's just do this one pass and then... We'll throw up a time lapse. We're not going to do the full field, though, I don't think, today, just because, well, one, I don't believe we're going to be able to fit everything in this combine until we get that trailer, uh, like in the storage up top. 
But number two is that I just, I don't know, I feel that saving it for another episode and we can also do that other field when that is, or maybe we'll live stream. I think that would be a good idea. Because, yeah, we, re, the main reason, though, is just we need that trailer. We definitely need that trailer. You know what? Let's just see what the trailers are looking like. So, hmm, hmm, hmm. Yeah, there is... There's lots of options. I would want probably something like this. Or, no, we could go with this. 27,000, though. It holds so much more than this 19,000 one. I feel like that's just worth it, right? Maybe it's just me who thinks that. I don't know. But we probably should take... Okay, okay, the other thing too is once we get the trailer, we'll be able to start making money. And for that reason, going with the bigger trailer might be worthwhile. It's just going to kind of put us in a little bit of a scary scenario or situation for a little bit. We do have a loan out already, so being down to like 3000 or $2,000 is definitely something we don't want to happen, but it might be necessary for us to start making money. Okay, so yeah, we did this pass. I'm just going to, I think now, start the time lapse. I think this is a pretty good part of the video for that. So, here we go. Okay guys, so we're 91% done. I think this is a good time to end the time lapse and we will just record uh, at normal speed and have commentary and everything over this last 10 or 9% actually of our uh, harvest. So yeah, there we go. It's already actually at 92% now. We're climbing up pretty quickly, 93. Yeah, it goes up every like, I don't know, five to 10 seconds, I'd say like 10 seconds. Yeah, like now it just hit 94%. If you guys are wondering where I'm getting that number, it's at the bottom right hand corner of the screen. It is beside where it says like the miles per hour that we're going and everything. It's that little line, it says soybeans underneath. Uh, but yeah, so that's pretty cool. And how we're we looking, we're at 96 guys, wow. Okay, I, I need to focus on this harvest though. I don't know why I keep looking down there because we're missing lots of crops. I hope we will get up to 100 in this pass. We should be able to do it. Oh yeah, 98. Yeah, we'll we'll make it before we get there. Uh, now what? Oh, whoops. One thing too, guys. I just wanted to mention. Oh yeah, I just I by mistake lifted that up. Um, one thing I want to mention is that oh, Liam's still on here. Wow. Uh, yeah, we missed a lot of crops. We really did. Uh, by we, I mean I did. I, I, I messed up, and that is something we definitely need to, or that I need to work on for in the future. So, there we go, though. We can turn this thing off. Uh, actually, what I'll do is, uh, no, we'll leave it here. But I'm going to turn this thing around, and we will go ahead and purchase this trailer. Now, I was debating doing it next video, but I think it just makes sense to do it now. So, here we go. And then, can I just put this out now, or is it going to... It shouldn't fall on the ground, right? I believe we need a trailer underneath. Yes. Okay, perfect. There we go. And yeah, let's go ahead and find a good trailer. So, I think the one we'll go with is going to be this one right here. Yeah, I think that will just make the most sense. Yeah, these are the same. One, see, okay. They have different driving 
types, right? I just, I don't know. This feels like it just makes sense to get. I believe we can even pull this one with, a, I don't know, like a, what's it called? A pickup truck, which is something we want to get in the future. Uh, what is this? Oh, okay. Uh, we can get it in white. And then for the wheels, I never know. Okay, not lizard. I think these ones work. Color. Oh, it costs money to change that. Mmm. Probably should just go with the green. Yeah. Oh, whoops, whoops, whoops. I'm so used to leasing stuff out. <laughs> there we go. $3,200 left in the bank. Let's tab on over to our tractor and open these doors. Perfect. Can even turn on the lights. I think that's actually the exterior lights because. Oh, no. Those are the interior lights. And detach here. Let's go to the shop. Yeah, should be pretty cool. I'm guessing Liam's going to want to ride. I don't know really actually don't know where Liam is he is somewhere on the map but yeah I think we should probably just start going actually to go out we go this way we might even see him see him when we're driving because he does have a farm pretty close to here if I show you guys he actually has farm uh, field 21 which honestly was a piece of land I was really hoping to get but it's okay he got it first and then he also has number six, but I'm really hoping we get number 12 because if he gets it, I'm going to be a little bit sad. Not going to lie, but it's fair game. If he wants it, he can, he can grab it. Here we go. There's Liam guys. There he is. Let's give him a little honk. Perfect. He's probably going to follow us. I'm guessing. Yep. There we go. He's turning around. Let's see how he does with turning. Uh, sorry, Liam, but like, that's some pretty terrible turning. <laughs> Probably thinks we're going to his farm, but we we are not going this way. And that was a stop sign, I know. Yeah, here's his farm, guys. Pretty nice. Let's see how much money he has. Uh, he is at seventy-eight thousand dollars in the bank. So I wonder if he's done a harvest yet, or maybe he just... Wait, is that a placeable shit he has as well? That red one, I feel like it's a placeable mod. Mm, maybe I'm wrong. I feel like it's got like Morton or something like that. I don't know. What is he doing? He's like really far behind now. I hope we're going the right way. I think this is. Let's actually check that. Yeah, no, it's right. Okay. What I'm going to do is drive on to the shop because it's going to be a little bit of a long ride. And I'll see you guys once we are there. Okay, let's pull on into here. And there is the trailer. I still have this header here. That's actually not ours. Uh, I, it was for a thumbnail and I ended up not using it and I just left it there. It's on another farm. Uh, it's kind of like the management farm, the money farm which is what people use when they run out of money completely and need our or need the bank's help. So yeah, I just I have that in here so we have money for worst case scenario, but let's see how this thing pulls. It's honestly pretty good so far. Okay, let's watch our turns though. Yeah, and then we can take off the cover just like so. That's pretty nice. So we can leave it on for now. Actually, I don't really need uh no, we'll leave it on just because I don't want any like debris from the trees falling on in there. We have a fire station here. This is actually where where we'll be turning. There we go. That mirror up there is completely useless now. It pretty much just shows that trailer. Nice. Actually, think all of the mirrors. Yeah. They're all pretty much useless now. The top one has the most use actually, but still not much of a purpose to even have that mirror with the trailer here. Wish these mirrors were like they stuck out further. So we don't have any on the on the hood or anything like that. Wonder are we gonna 
see Liam here. Do you think he's going to be following us, guys? I, I'm guessing he might. Let's actually make sure we're going the right way. Oh, he's actually just down the road. Yeah, we'll be passing by him. Yeah, we could go off-roading, but we'll take the main streets. Why not? Look at that ditch, guys. If we fall down there someday... Um, well, okay, this tractor should be able to make it out. I don't think a pickup truck would, though. We'd probably need to get some kind of winch brought in here and a tow hook to rescue ourselves. Which, yeah, let's just hope that doesn't happen. That just sounds expensive. It's We would probably have to rent out the equipment. There's no way we would buy a winch. Unless it becomes like a consistent thing. Okie dokie, there's Liam, guys. There we go. Actually, I don't need all these lights on. We'll honk at him. Hello. What? what what's up, Liam? Oh, he hopped on in. <laughs> there we go. Oh, he's sitting now. How did he sit down there? I did not know you could sit down there. Oh, that is so cool. Wow. I really like this. I'm going to need Liam for the thumbnail picture, I think. <laughs> Yeah, that is really, really nice. I hope his name goes away for when we take the thumbnail. I don't know. That, yeah, that's, that's awesome. He's in a great position there. Okay. Hey, don't fall off, Liam. What if I just, like, slam the brakes? Woo. <laughs> nah, he's, he stays on. He's holding pretty tight. He's actually just holding on with one hand, but. Yeah, guys, Liam works out, I guess. I don't know. We go. What's the street called again? Hickory Avenue. Perfect. And we'll just go down here. So, guys, that is it for this video. Next video, we'll start off by unloading the combine and then we'll go to sell. And that should be pretty good. I'm going to have to actually record that video in not too long because we do have a loan out right now, which means every day we get charged some money. I believe it's only like $100 the game but it's gonna add up especially when we're down to three thousand dollars we cannot just sit here for a few weeks or anything like, we will go completely bankrupt <laughs> so yeah we gotta watch out for that anyways join the discord server links down below if you want to join the server you guys can go ahead and join the patreon page so that's pretty cool that's also found down below and that's about it you guys are awesome shout out to liam for joining in on the server Bye bye. Want to play games with your friends? Grab a dedicated server from G Portal. Make sure to click the link down below to receive an instant 5% discount.